Here are my clean code principles that all software engineers need to understand unnecessary levels of nesting. So I challenge you, have a look at this code and ask yourself what's wrong with it and how could you make this code cleaner. So what you want to do here is you want to try to make this code as flat as possible. So we'll leave this down here. I'll just kind of add a comment and say old code. And up here, I'm going to write the new code. So we're going to start by writing something like this. If the number is less than or equal to zero, then we're going to take this value here. So print skipping the number is not positive and we are going to continue to the next number. And then lastly, we have the condition that we do want to check. So there's kind of multiple ways to do this. But what I'm going to do is say if the number is greater than or equal to 100, then same thing. I'm going to take this print statement. I'm going to say print skipping and then I'm going to continue. And now we can copy what we do want to do. I'm going to get rid of all of this and I can just do this at the bottom of the for loop. Whereas if none of these things are true, that means that this number qualifies like we would have had in those nested if statements and we can append it to the results list.